Hey guys, what's up? Um, this is our first ever video on our brand new channel, FW Fishing Crew. And today, we're gonna give you a little introduction about our new channel. So first of all, we'll be talking about who our crew is. So right now, as is, is me, Kate Holta. And me, Luke Schultz. And then we have two others who actually aren't here today. And that's Grant Mech and Ryan Lindy. And um, first off, we're gonna start talking about the Mr. Twister. Now, well, here are some of our baits. So first, we like to use the Mr. Twister. And basically, it catches anything on the river. Yep, anything. And this is also Ryan Lindy's favorite thing to use on the river. Yep, he just slays anything with these. Oh yeah. We use multiple colors of these. And you can just put them on a simple jig head like this one. Yep. Um, so we use multiple colors such as these white. There's pearl white and white. You can easily tell the difference between the two right there. And we got multicolored pink on top, white on bottom. Yep, and then we got the green and purple. Maybe black with some red. Yep. A lot of them. Alright, next we'll show you some of our Rapalos that we use. So, we use many Rapalos. We love Rapalos. Rapalos are actually my favorite lure. And uh, so I use Jointed Red Crawdad is one of my favorites. Also Grant's. He had it. I got the idea of getting this lure from him. And, uh, and this is my favorite, the Balsa Floating. It is the perfect lure for catching bass. I also use non-jointed ones. Just normal shads work like a charm. My favorite lure has got to be this little shad though. You can see in the size difference between the two. I don't know if you can tell the difference between the two, but this one's a lot smaller and I have land or I didn't actually land it. I had about a 30 inch walleye on this little guy. Oh, it didn't was a monster. Him. I was didn't there. land him. I was pissed. I about I laid down for about five minutes. Didn't say a word. I was really pissed off. Yeah, it was huge fish. And these are my favorite to use on the river. Yep. Swim baits are also something we use. They are my specialty. Luke loves the swim baits. Um, next. Let's talk about, we got crankbaits. We use crankbaits every once in a while. I had a really nice crankbait. It was about a $7 crankbait. Uh, I actually ended up losing it on a, on a huge ass rock. Uh, I was really pissed off about that. It was about a 20 minute fight and then I decided to cut the line. I was really mad. Um, and floaters. Also floor. use those. And top, yeah, top water. This is my favorite one to use. Yep. We will Double also propeller. throw it top water. I got two Rebel poppers here. Love hula poppers. And maybe toss out a frog every now and then, but probably not on the river. Yep. See, Grant loves top water. I can't really speak for him and say that that's his favorite lure, but he does love top water. He was actually getting some monster hits by Northern today. Oh, yeah. On the it river, is, on his big. buzz bait. And you guys are probably wondering why Kate has an ass load of daredevils. Huh. Yeah, actually I got all these from my grandpa. Because we aren't gonna we are not gonna use any of these. Unless if you guys want us to do a do a challenge. Yep, challenge sure. maybe we can whip them out. Maybe see who can catch the most fish or maybe even a fish on them. Yeah. But we will not be using those. Um Last of all, what are we talking about? Oh, one thing. You guys probably are wondering if we have this. bobbers. We are not gonna use bobbers. We're maybe, just waste of time. maybe, if we're really bored, we'll maybe throw out a bobber. If we can't catch on any our fish, shitty Lake Billsby, maybe catch a sheephead. Yeah, those are my favorite. 
or a freshwater drum if you really want to say that. Um, next we'll be talking about our rods and reels. So I got the Ugly Stick GX2 spinning reel. And uh, Grant also has an Ugly Stick. I'm pretty sure it's a GX2. His is actually, we both have medium actions, but he does not have a spinning reel like this. He has a bait caster on it. And his is actually nicer. But also costs him more money, but it's a ni nicer rod. And I'll be talking about the rod I will be using tomorrow. Oh uh, yeah, Luke. Luke's using one of my rods. Because I have spider wire on my other rod and it is not. Yep. He got spider wire, or he has spider wire line. So on his the, other rod. So the real, Lots of tangles, so he's using mine. With the 20 pound, with the 20 pound braid is a Mitchell. And there's nothing really else to talk about of this rod. I'll just be using it tomorrow. Pinnacle. Pinnacle rod. That's what it is. Alright, well, I think that's all we got for you guys today. Tune in tomorrow for some slaying bass, probably walleye. Might get a northern. And we will be fishing on the river, and Ryan and... Ryan Grant and Grant will be... send in some footage of... Yep. We won't be actually fishing with those guys, but they will be fishing and we will be too. So, so tune in tomorrow. Like, video. subscribe, comment. Share with your friends. We'll see ya.